Hey street team, welcome back to Danny TV where we bring what's going on in these streets to your TV. If you are new here, welcome. My name is Danielle, so make sure that you guys like, comment, and subscribe because y'all know we're about to go up. Okay, super excited. It's my birthday weekend. So I'm doing all of the things that I've been wanting to do for a while and some things that I have on my bucket list. Today is Friday and I'm about to go horseback riding on the beach. How fun is that y'all? I'm so excited and this is something that I've been wanting to do for a very, very long time. Sunday is my actual birthday and I'm going skydiving. That's gonna be like super crazy. Everyone is telling me that I'm crazy because I'm literally about to jump out of a plane but I'm feeling more so like YOLO, only live once and we gotta do some fun stuff. Y'all, I am literally about to go horseback riding. Okay, I think this is gonna be my helmet. <laughs> Let me see your helmet. <laughs> Got a bike helmet. I know. No, okay, this is the bike helmet. I don't want the bike helmet. I hate putting on stuff that all the other people had on their head. Oh. Fix the way. biker one but I also don't want one that's like killer big on my head because my head is small this one a little tight okay here we go let's see what happens are you watching a safety video oh uh, excuse me think we should do something crazy Put your leg over and sit down for me. You straight got your purse. That's hilarious. All right. Just hold on, look at me, and listen. Put your legs up here in front of you. Mm -hmm. Bend your knees. Oh. You always want your feet in mm -hmm. front of you. Okay. Use your thighs and your core to keep your balance, not your feet and your hands. Hold on. Do that now while I'm walking you where you're not using your feet and your hands. Mm -hmm. So what you're going to do is just tuck your knees in, use your core. Just like that. Stop. Okay. Use your core and your balance. All right. Just like that. So which one is the oldest? Which one is the oldest? Are they brother and sister in there? No, that's two girls. Um, besties. <laughs> yeah, and that one included. She's just there's not enough room in there for three. Which ones do you guys enjoy riding the most? Uh, I ride that little turd right there. I ride in sushi, and she's real nice. I like riding all of them. This one right here, I ride a lot. Sushi is awesome. They're all really good horses. Those two over there, they'll walk out together. So when people get on them, we have to do it last because they're ready to go. And they'll just follow right beside each other. And then there's two other horses, Will and Phil. They're brother and sister. Oh, God. You don't separate them. Yeah, they won't. They go Phil together, too. Phil brings the gate for the you to do. He will bust out. So how his tail gets so short? Huh? How his tail gets so short? The, the Amish. He pulled, or she, she pulled the, the machine for, like, the fields and stuff. They do that because they use equipment. Uh -huh. they, they work them. Those are work horses. And they cut their tails so it doesn't get caught in the machine. Oh. <laughs> How you zoom in? It's a little button at the top. And it should zoom in. A little button. You doing it? You want you slide to the side? Yeah. Mm-hmm. 
Yeah, I'm doing it. Stuffed collard greens? But if you go there, ask for Michelle. That's my best friend. Michelle. Michelle. We've been best friends since kindergarten. I'm 50. That's a long time. That's a long time. <laughs> that's a really long time. What about to be best friends with somebody? Um. I want to ride know, that one. Like, uh, Man, he got scars on him. I think I, I want to ride that one. Who, who's that? Him? He got scars a scar on him. I want to ride that guy. Look at that scar on his side. Her? Yeah. Where's the scar? The little thing right here? That's not a scar? That's not a scar. No, that's just the change of pattern in her. Oh, okay, okay, I got you. Her, that's called their flank. Look at hers. It, it looks different. Oh, yeah, see? I see it. Yeah, it looks different. All right, buddy, should lay go over and sit down for me? Yes, ma'am. And I'll fix your stirrups in just a moment. I want you to do the same thing I just told her to do, okay? Mm -hmm. I want you to sit up really straight with your back straight. Sit up straight, there you go. Use your thighs and your core to keep your balance. Let go with your hands. Just practice it right now. Sit up straight. I'm not straight right now? No, you want your back straight. Okay. All right, kind of arched. Yeah, Mom. You. You'll get it. That's how you keep your balance, not with your feet and your hands. Too many people try to keep their feet with their balance with their feet and their hands, and that's not how you how do it. How did you get the white horse? I wanted the white horse. Oh. I really wanted to ride that tall guy. <laughs> Everybody wants to ride her. For real? That's crazy. That's yeah, legit who I wanted. Worked a lot lately, so if I don't have to use her, like yeah. for weight purposes or something, I try not to because she has worked a lot lately. I love how you take you taking the camera. And also, those horses come from Ohio, mm -hmm. so it's hot, and we're really watching them during this heat and everything to see how they're gonna do. Yeah, because they're used to the cold weather. Yeah. We uh Her we give right them the electrolytes and stuff like that in the summertime. She's the real Oh wow, I didn't even know. And uh, we give them something that's called sweet okay, tea. So you take sweet feed really and you soak it in water, and they drink the juice yeah. off of it, mm -hmm. and it hydrates them. Hold on to this. Do not let go of that. That's your steering wheel and your brakes. They're not very good friends, so let's keep them separated. Okay, because okay, oh. yeah, he keep they moving. Don't really it. like each other. Yeah, he keep moving I'm the little girl. April moving. She don't want him over like here. Her. She'll lay her ear. If you see her lay her ears back, that. you'll know something's wrong. Come here, turd. Uh, uh, you and Dream need to back up. April not playing that. I told him April. I say fuck everyone. Just run away from the daily routine. Oh yeah, he is fast. I feel like I'm twisting my butt all the way down to the Bucket list stuff. That's fast track, I think. Sneezing? I was wondering what that was. Look at Eric and Dream. so much fun yesterday doing the horseback riding on the beach it was so relaxing um my horse name was april eric's horse name was dream and april did not mess with dream like april was eating and then dream came near her and she like turned her head because she was like girl gone somewhere and then when we were on the beach the instructor was like okay keep dream away from april because april will turn around and bite dream um, Eric said yesterday that Disney, I mean, the, <laughs> Eric said yesterday that the horseback riding on the beach was better than Disney. I do not agree. Like, although it was so relaxing, 
Disney is just like so much fun and magical because I went there, I think like two years ago for my birthday and I went to Magic Kingdom, but Eric is like nature boy and he liked to be outside. So he literally was in heaven. He got on um, the horseback riding instructor last nerve because the whole ride, he kept saying, dream, you're amazing. Like, <laughs> Did you or did you not keep saying that? You kept saying, dream, you're amazing. The lady straight, the lady came back and was like, when we came back to the state, I think it's called stable. The lady was like, that's what I had to hear the whole ride. Our instructor was really nice um, and cool too. So you think that horseback riding on the beach is better than Magic Kingdom and Disney World? Yeah, cause, because I'm a dude and the princess stuff wasn't really exciting at um, Disney. And we went to the princess stuff because it was your birthday. <laughs> That was so funny. Eric was like, she a little kid in heaven. <laughs> All right. So today's activity is Cypress Garden. Um, it's in Charleston. So that's about two hours away from Savannah. But they have like the paddle boat. It's so romantic and it's really cute. It's where the notebook was filmed. So I'm really excited. We're about to go there. I just have on, um, let me move my chair. I just have on a set that I got from Fashion Nova and I had to like literally stretch this out to get it over my head. And I was like, bro, who the hell can fit this shirt? Because like the hole was literally like this small and it can go over like nobody's head, but really cute and simple. And then I have my Yeezys on. I'm about to pack my sunglasses because yesterday I forgot my sunglasses. So yeah, let's get on the road, quick little road trip and yeah. Birthday festivities, everything is like bucket list ish. It's not that I don't want you here. It's something about the way you stare tonight. We finally made it to the place. When you said it and I looked up and I saw it, I was like, dang, somebody's having a wedding here. Um, I would not, but hey. I'm a little nervous because on this boat tour, you can see like alligators, y'all. Eric want to see an alligator so bad. nervous y'all hello hi how we doing good how are you i'm actually paddling hurry up bb we gotta get skirt skirt past them i don't like them y'all they made us mad so we, it's a race until the bird we gotta hurry up it's <laughs> you saying the wrong thing skirt skirt <laughs> Go on, hands, skirt, skirt, pass. Y'all should have did the guided tour. <laughs> Y'all should have did the guided tour. <laughs> it was hellas of them or whatever, and when we came up, they was in a group, so they had paid for a guided tour, and then they hopped out of line to get in a guided tour line. Then they hurried up and decided to get back in front of us, and it's like hellas in them, and it's like a, it was like a long wait. So I'm like, at this point, we beefing. Cause y'all need to stay back there. So they were struggling with a boat and we hurried up and got uh, right in front of them. So we went in the competition y'all. And then that's why y'all heard Eric talking about y'all should have did the guided tour. Cause it's like y'all did all that just to be right back behind us. But it's so nice out here. I'm struggling y'all. Cause this boat old as hell. <laughs> BB, where you at? We going the wrong way. What side am I supposed to be on? <laughs> on this on this side? Oh. Okay. Eric has been a tour guide for a while now. He you know he's good at this boat stuff. He knows how to do this. So 
side. You on this side. I'm on this side. I wish this had paddles so we can just sail and not push. This is so beautiful and peaceful. If I wrote you a symphony Just to say how much you mean to me What would you do If I told you you were beautiful Oh no, we gotta bend down low. Okay, so these arrows right here tell us where to go on the actual tour. What is for the work, BB? How are we about to do this? Uh, what you gonna do? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Help! Send help! I'm scared. <laughs> We did it. We did it, Joe. <laughs> BB, we getting us a self We getting us a guided tour for free. We can hear everything he's saying now. <laughs> uh oh. No, no. Back to record. Back to <laughs> I am blog. recording. I don't need no more paddler help from the paddler. Go this way? From the old oh, infamous paddler, that's her name. We gotta play some slow jams. Huh? We gotta play some snow, slow jams. We gotta do what? Play some slow jams. <laughs> we about to hit the tree. <laughs> oh. oh, thank you. She said, y'all been hit the tree, be careful. All right, now you take it. <laughs> beep, 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 Put those stick in there. I'm sure. That's the reason why they gave the life jackets to the kids. Cause we oh, we can stand up in this. It makes sense. I can see us holding hands, walking on the beach, our toes in the sand. I can see us on the countryside. Danny's first time paddling <laughs> the whole ride, and we're almost done. I was paddling. Did I feel the boat BB, you know what's so funny? What? If we both paddle on the opposite side at the same time, we would just go straight. Uh -huh. That's why I kept telling you to just paddle like, look, you see how we going straight? Yeah. That's what I'm saying. It's the simple mechanics. Oh, I didn't know that. Both? Okay, wait, what's happening? We're about to hit the I stopped, I stopped, I stopped paddling with you because I'm oh, trying to record right. you. I'm about to be in the BB, you were supposed to put your paddle against the tree and push yourself away. See how easy it is? Push your body away. She's so cool, guys. She's just not an outdoors lady. <laughs> She's not an outdoors lady. Oh my God. Why are we turning?
so I seen Shot Us for the first time yesterday, y'all. It's Eric's favorite movie, and it was so lit. It's the movie with Bob Marley. I was hella sad when uh, Wayne died. Okay, BB, explain the movie. What you mean, explain? Explain Shot Us. It's one of the most best gangster movies ever. Boy, shut up. You think it's better than Menace to Society? Boys in the Hood? It depends on... Is it better than Power? Yeah. Don't get me started. Please do not get me started on my shows, okay? How beautiful is this? What's my favorite color? What's my favorite color? They having a wedding, y'all. This is kind of, I don't know if I would have a wedding here, but I guess it's kind of magical because this is where the notebook was filmed. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I about that. That is amazing. I decided to try um, Huey McGoo's. So this is what the food looks like. We got the four two meal. We got toast, garlic parmesan, and sweet heat tenders. Blue cheese, cause I'm a blue cheese lover. And then the magoo sauce. It's supposed to be like Zaxby's in a way. And then also like Cane's. I'm trying to think. Yeah, I seen online that they said it was like Zaxby's and Cane's. So we're trying to fry. The Magoo sauce actually tastes like cane sauce. So this is like literally canes, but with sauce tenders. Mm. We love blue cheese. The toast is good. Okay, TikTok don't never leave me wrong. Let's see about the tenders. Okay, y'all, everything is good. I'm excited. Try garlic parm. Okay, I think that this is better than Zaxby's. No lie. I like Zaxby's. I do like Zaxby's. I just think that they're overrated, but this is definitely better than Zaxby's. You don't like Zaxby's, though. You know, I never heard you say, let's go get some Zaxby's. I did, when you used to live in a truck driving area. Because <laughs> it was the only place like by your house. I like Zaxby's, but I do feel like it's overhyped. This is fire. The boat experience was fun, but I'm just not like an out girl, <laughs> an outdoors girl. So I think the whole experience was a nine out of 10. But as far as me and the paddle boat, I mean the boat, like that's just not my thing. But I did want to try something different. My food from Huey's, I would rate that an eight out of 10. So I feel like the food overall was a 10 out of 10, but I had to like clean the table that we sat at because it was dirty and the lemonade was not good. But like I told y'all, I did like the chicken strips. I probably will see y'all in the morning um, when I'm getting ready for Cycle Bar or on my way to Cycle Bar. Good morning, y'all. It's my birthday, February 26th, okay. It's officially Pisces season. I am on my way um, to Cycle Bar and I'm running late. They have some rules that you like can't be late. So I just called them and I'm like, I'm running a minute late. It's my birthday. I can be late on my birthday. The lady was like, as long as you're in by the first song, sis. It's my birthday and I can be late on my birthday. It's giving birthday behavior. But I'm really excited um, to go. I'm really proud of myself, y'all, because I've been making this commitment going to Cycle Bar. Like, I'm literally up early on my birthday, not going to brunch, but going to the gym and going to Cycle Bar. So that's huge for me. Um, later on today, after the gym, I'm going skydiving. So, y'all, okay. 
this idea literally popped in my head this week and I was like you know what I'm gonna go skydiving for my birthday how much fun would that be right but then like this morning I was looking up videos on TikTok and I was like what the hell like I'm going skydiving y'all I'm literally going to be jumping out of an airplane this is crazy and then I saw like when people were going skydiving and they freaking were landing on their feet child i hope that that's not the one that i'm doing because that's just a little bit too much for me i need to do the one where they pull me back in the airplane because i don't have time to be trying to land on my feet Ooh, i'm clumsy and i'm gonna mess around and fall and break my ankle or something so I'm a little bit nervous, but YOLO, I think it's gonna be really, really fun. This birthday has been special to me because I've been doing like all of the things that were that was on my bucket list. So skydiving and then the horseback riding on the beach. So later on tonight, I'm going out to eat. It's time to get back into business. Like I need to get back on the scene and start networking. I wanna, you know, continue to go to more events in Atlanta when I first started my channel I was like really 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 on the scene y'all and events have kind of like dried up and then I or if I find out about some it's like really late notice so I need to make more of an effort to find out because I miss that content and I feel like that's where some of y'all came from in general because y'all like seeing me out there on the scene and hustling so that's pretty much where I am um, right now. I'm about to pull up to Cycle Bar. It's my birthday. They playing Ratchet Happy Birthday for me. And I'm really excited. Just a little of reflecting. It's crazy because like some of the things that happened in my life happened in my life. I would literally say, oh, I want to do this and I have to do that. Never in my life did I know that I would have those moments right. Like, oh, crap. Oh, I should have turned right there. Never in my life did I know that I would have had those moments like before I hit my age. And I'm not telling y'all my age either. Okay, we're at Cycle Bar. Let's get... Sorry, I'm running a stop sign. If it's a cop watching this video, please don't give me a ticket. Okay, we're here. It looked like it's jumping. And they're also playing um, black people music today. <laughs> black people music. They're also celebrating black artists today. All right, y'all, let me shut up because I got to hurry up and run in here. Okay, so y'all know I was late and I was rushing in there and then as I go in, I'm putting my shoes on and I hear go, go, go shawty. It's your birthday. And if you know me, you know that that like real life is my song. So anyway, when I walked in, so look, I'm putting my shoes on and Kaylin, my trainer, she's like, uh-uh, the birthday girl better show up, right? She's like, the birthday girl better show up because I'm late. So then I walk in and it's like, go shawty. It's your birthday. So like really, really, really set the mood. And then she decorated my bike for me. She got, wrote me a little cute little note, happy birthday. And it has a little sticker on there that says yay fitness. And um, she decorated my locker for me too. I love my gym. Who would have thought that I would like get into fitness and literally go to the gym on my birthday? Like this is crazy. My sister sent me such a sweet message. It said, happy birthday, sister. I hope today more than ever you realize how blessed you are. It's so dope to know that you really are designing the life that you want and that you are in the middle of a prayer you once had. I know things may not be perfect, but what is perfect is your determination and how no matter what you make it happen, period. Miss make it happen. Don't lose that. I'm so proud of you and I admire your fearlessness. I thank God for blessing me with someone as pure as you to do life with. I hope this year brings you everything you want and more. It's always us, never them. 
happy birthday love you for life and after why am i yelling y'all i don't know i'm really hyped because it's my birthday and we're gonna set the mood and we about to play in the club with bottles full of books <laughs> i have a problem let me see because me and 50 go way back he he over all the shows that i love Y'all didn't sweat my hair out. I gotta go home and shower and get ready to freaking jump off an airplane. Oh! I can't dance. Go, Shawty! It's your birthday! It's your birthday, baby. It's your birthday. Yeah. Who's gonna love you on your worst day? All right, y'all. I am about to go skydiving. I'm about 40 minutes out. I'm really, really nervous, but we're about to do this. This is crazy. Anyway, I have a makeup appointment at 4 30 and the skydiving people said that this is gonna take four to five hours um i don't understand how this is gonna take four to five hours but i need to get in and out because sis gotta get her makeup done but i don't think it hit me that i'm literally about to jump off an airplane like this is literally crazy this is crazy but whatever we're about to do this and ain't no turning back so i'll see y'all once i get to the place also do video as well so i have my info card and then i am about to pick some music off this list so far i have moment for life by Nicki minaj california love tupac y'all know we love tupac and then i'm trying to think of what's another song i should put on here we're gonna do turn down for what all right so i picked my music here's that thank you you're all set uh, your instructor will start calling your name in just a few okay cool we'll be tired with the crown I'm not lucky, I'm blessed, yes Clap for the heavyweight champ, me But I couldn't do it all alone We, young money raised me Grew up out in Baisley Southside Jamaica, Queens and it's crazy Cause I'm still hood, Hollywood couldn't change me Shout out to my haters, I'll be that you couldn't phase me Ain't pity cocky, we just vindicated Best believe that when we done this moment We'll be syndicated, I don't know This night just remind me of Everything they deprived me of Put your drinks up It's, it's a celebration every time we link up
I don't kill them this soon. Why you say I did nothing for you when I for do anything you want me to do? Timbani can do a jewel. Oh my don't kill them this soon. Why you say I did nothing for you when I for do anything you want me to do? Maybe another time, maybe another life. You will be my wife and we'll get it right. can see from that video i was looking real rough okay but um skydiving was such a fun experience i don't know if i would do it again though because i felt like i was in the air for too long and i was only in the air for 50 seconds but that was the longest 50 seconds of my life okay uh, my instructor was so nice shout out to him because he got me through the whole process and he went with with me as well but y'all shout out and then y'all saw at the end that i had failed i was like oh my god like danielle what are you doing the dang on parachute was blowing <laughs> when when you're landing you're supposed to prepare to land on your butt so my legs were like out and then i have put them in because i'm like oh like naturally just stand up and yeah i kept literally hitting the ground a man had to like pull me up the parachute is trying to fly away and do his thing um i should have took my carmax with me because i'm up in the air and i'm like bro my lips are chapped okay i can't be on the camera with chapped lips but yeah it was um so much fun so I did 10,000 feet in the air um, and somebody else that was on the plane did 15,000 and then it was other people that are just like riders and they were like jumping out on their own because they have a license and then you have people that just got on there to ride along but y'all I just started like it's been probably an hour in 30 minutes and i'm just now starting to feel normal because it was like it was fun but like after a while of being in the air i'm like bro i feel like i'm about to throw up sienna's like why is the camera not going right cut it right okay. <laughs> <Yes. Scorpio. laughs> no because our channel is so good you need to subscribe okay there we go <laughs> um who you thought had the best dress wendy Okay, yes. Yeah. Worse. Giselle. Okay, I'm glad you're telling the truth. I mean, the dress was awful. What are you and talking about? Um, oh, Housewives of Potomac. Um, it's just... See, I'm only on it. Why did, There's so many other ones. I, I don't know. Like if they would have left it plain, it would have been fine. 
like all that. You know she was trying to duplicate that Balenciaga dress. Oh, uh, she should have put that back. She <laughs> never can get it right, and it's like. You can I, hire a stylist. Yeah, and that's my thing. Like, I think she's a really pretty lady. Like, she looks good for her yeah. age, but the dress was not it at all. It was awful. And you look pretty. Oh, it's like a headshot. Really? Oh, so <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> okay. A little bit. Okay, right there, right there. It's perfect. Guys, she's like a dog. Yeah. That's so pretty. <laughs> I can't take it. I can't take it. No, look at pretty. Look, my makeup. It photographs well. Oh, yeah, it's so cute. Look I like it. Shot. Damn it. That video. Yes, I love it. It is so cute. Hey, street team. I'm back at home. How cute do I look, y'all? And how cute is the makeup? We love a good, simple glam. My dress was super cute. I'll insert a picture on the screen. I had went and got my makeup done and then I came home and had to hurry up and get ready for dinner. So bonefish, um, I ended up getting steak, shrimp, mashed potatoes, and a Caesar salad. I got this dress a while ago and I was waiting for the perfect occasion to wear it. And I feel like, okay girl, wear it on your birthday. Feels so cute. And my makeup looks so good, y'all. I love, love, love my makeup. Every time that I go to Ulta, they slap me, no doubt. It's giving like really, really glowy. Um, Let me show y'all something I actually bought from Ulta today, hold on. So they end up giving me a birthday gift, which was some mascara from Lancome. And I've been kind of into them lately, especially the serum that I got from them. They got Zendaya on here so um the representative told me that this was really really good so i'm gonna try that some lashes from kiss which i actually have on um and then i got this cleanser from mac because mac has skincare now and i heard that this cleanser is really really good so i'm excited to try this and it's a big bottle too I think I'm gonna go back and get more things that um, from their skincare line because the last time that I was there, Tiana prepped my skin with the MAC skincare and then Erin who did my makeup today prepped me as well. I like them y'all, they are so nice, they're my friends. And then what else did I get? Okay, I got Lock Kiss Ink from MAC Lipstick. I'm not really a red girl. But Erin and Tiana had me stepping outside of the box today. They did this really cute look with like the lip liner and this, and it was so freaking fire. But of course, once I got home, it was just something totally different. And then I put this on and it was not giving the vibes that they did at Ulta, but whatever. So that's what I purchased from them. I'm really, really excited to, to try the cleanser. And I'm gonna try it probably tomorrow. And I'll show y'all. Well, I'm not going to say that I'm going to show y'all because this vlog is about to end. I'll tell y'all about it and maybe show it in my next vlog. And I think I'm going to talk about it on TikTok. So make sure that you guys follow me on TikTok, Danny TV underscore, because TikTok is really like still in my heart these days. I mean, I'm not talking about my shows, y'all. And I'm really, 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 really passionate about that. But anyway, I've had such a great birthday like I did everything that I wanted to do, like bucket list things, and it was just so much fun. So yeah, um, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Make sure that you guys like, comment, and subscribe, and we are on our way to a thousand subscribers. So yeah, thank you guys as always. Happy birthday to me!